Hi, Atomic Amy here. I'm going to talk to you today about building an edible hibernation den. And so you can build, basically this is an opportunity for your children to get really creative and build a little hibernation den for one of their little friends to survive the winter. And so one of the topics you can discuss with them is why would an animal hibernate? Why would a bear want to go in a cave and sleep for six months? And so talk about the winter, talk about how it helps them survive, and then talk too about how animals will use different things from their environment like leaves and sticks, um, caves, burrowing under the roots of trees to build themselves a little nest, both so they can stay warm and so that they're hidden from predators. And so you can grab anything from your pantry, like we've got gumdrops here, we've got mini marshmallows, we've got pretzel sticks, we've got toothpicks. Um, you can grab big marshmallows, you can get raisins, basically anything you can stick a stick in. I would say my favorite are the toothpicks um, because they're really sturdy and they have a point. Um, if you have a very young child, you might help them with that and then have them put the pieces together. You can see that this is my one built with toothpicks and I filled in the spaces with marshmallows, much like an animal would fill it in with leaves or dirt or mud or whatever. Um, and I put my little tiger in here. Don't worry about having the exact figurines. Let them pick their favorite friend that they want to help hibernate and talk through like, you know, what do you like to sleep with? What might you like in there? You might like a nice warm bed. And this one obviously is the simplest design. Um, you could get a piece of fabric and drape it over it and pretend it's a cave. Um, but really they can just get creative you know talk with them about engineering if they're an older child like what are the steps like you have to design you have to think through the problem like how are you going to build this like see this is more of like a teepee with it, everything going up to the middle and then this is more of an a-frame and so depending on the age of the child you can talk about a lot of different topics but the main thing is building a warm home for your friend and so you can see with this i just stabbed several gumdrops and built it up one fun thing you can do is get shredded coconut and sprinkle it over the top like snow and see, um, you know, hey, how did it do? Did any coconut get inside? Um, and then, of course, your child can eat it at the end. And so I hope you guys have fun building your edible hibernation den. Um, and I hope you'll join us next time.